Hi, I'm Shivesh Ganotra, PME for Cisco. When it comes to checking the build quality of a product, it is important to understand how much of an effort has the vendor actually put in to ensure an extremely durable product manufactured using the highest grade standards. Today, I'll be demonstrating a simple creative test case scenario to analyze the differences in the quality of access points between Cisco and Aruba. Let's check it out. So this is what I call a two minute water resistance test. What we have over here is a client which is connected to the access point and constantly pinging the cable. Now while this connection is still active, we will drop this access point into the glass tank which is one fourth filled with water. And start the timer. Now we will wait to see if this access point can successfully sustain this active connection for at least two minutes while the water logs into the internal circuits. We will start with the 11 NAPs first with Aruba 135 and AP3600 from Cisco and then move on to the 11 ACE models with the AP3700 and the recently redesigned AP225 from Aruba. So how does a Cisco access point resist so much moisture for such a long duration? The answer lies in the quality of the access point. If you look on the inside of a flagship access point, you will notice besides using higher grade components, Cisco makes use of an additional sealant in terms of a rubber gasket. This gives an additional layer of protection to the access points, enabling higher resistance against moisture, dirt and daily wear and tear of the body. Until next time, thank you for watching.